I have been waiting forever. Now it seems like forever. I'm not sure. I will flash it on the screen. It does print out here um, when it was sent, which is April 12th, and today is April 16th. So it shipped in a hurry. It was just waiting for them to make it. It took forever. All right. I am super excited. I've been waiting for so long. All right. Oh. Okay, can't bend it. Sorry. <laughs> Yay! Okay. Oh, what's this? Oh. Took that out. Worms! I don't really understand. I mean, I do get why they do the worms, but, you know, whatever. Ooh, this one's beautiful. This is called Sugar Blueberry. And by the way, thank you, Foxy Fix, for printing the names on these things, because it was really confusing before. This feels cool. I love blue. Very nice. Last time I got lapis, which was a different leather. I think it might have been spice. I'm not sure, but it was really beautiful filling. Okay, so um, this is the only other thing I ended up getting. I think it's funny they had to fit it in here. That's cute. I can always use these um, pieces of cardboard for a lot of things. Um, and this is one of the... Um, adhesives that they make um, and this one like it'll fit like my ID in it perfectly so that's why I bought that and I will open this in a second all right the big reveal this is for my Hobonichi weeks so last time I had a really rough experience with Foxy Fix but I did mention that I would give them a second chance I was gonna wait a while I didn't wait very long because when it came time to find a cover for my Hobonichi weeks I felt like this was the right move for me. So let's see how it looks. Oh, so nervous. Don't be. It's going to be great. Ooh, yes, it looks great so far. Ooh, yes. Ooh, this leather does not feel how I thought it would feel. It's beautiful. It's a little more squishier than I thought it would be. That's kind of cool. Oh, it's lovely. Very lovely. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. Get yourself together, Sylvia. All right. <laughs> Okay, so this is the, um, I, I want to say it right. Let me get my information. Okay, so first of all, let me say that when I, it came time for me to find a cover on cover for my weeks, I, I thought about Foxy Fix and I, I decided on them for several reasons, but, um, I wanted to kind of do what a lot of people do. I went onto YouTube and I was searching for this cover and I couldn't find it anywhere. I mean, and so I was like, okay, this is ridiculous. I'm going to go to the source, right? Into the source. I don't mean Foxy Fix. I mean, John Rush because he's like John Rush, right? And John let me down. I could not find a video by John Rush. And this is by, um, Foxy Fix and it's called the uh, Perfect Fit Cover and I think he did have a Perfect Fit Cover but it wasn't um, for the Hobonichi Weeks it was for something else and so I thought okay you know John doesn't have it but you know Mommy Reporter she's totally gonna have something and she let me down and I thought what's going on man so I thought I'd bite the bullet and be the first to try this out so that if you were wondering about it but a little skeptical because you haven't seen anything here you go. So this is the perfect fit cover and it is in the Boss Babe leather and that is the, the type of leather and it's in the color um, Madison Avenue which is just black and it's gorgeous. Then down here I ended up getting a butterfly um, and I think it's called an embossing. Yeah um, you can get like a font or an animal or you know, whatever. And so I ended up getting the butterfly and then I ended up getting it foiled in silver. Is it not beautiful? Oh, I love it. So pretty. And then I did get the black stitching with black elastic because, you know, I'm just going really crazy with all of this. Um, I don't know. I'm just black everything right now. I just think it's so classic and sleek. And um, I can understand why they decided to call this the uh, Madison Avenue because it is very chic. Um, and then this is how the inside looks. Now, I didn't know this until I went on to order. Um, but they do have what is called... Um, 
I don't remember. Well, they have three different layouts on the inside. This is one, and then they have the crisscross one that kind of goes like this, and you have one pocket, and then it goes overlapping, and you have a second one, and then they have a small pocket in front of both of those. That's three layers of leather, and I wasn't sure how that was going to look as far as thickness goes. This seems pretty thick. It doesn't look super crazy, but it is thick. So I didn't want to try the crisscross, even though it's more of the new style that Foxy Fix offers. And then I think the third one was just like the um, secretarial pockets. I can't remember off the top of my head. And then this has like a, a slit back here. Um, so you could put a card or something. I don't really know. I feel like you would put a card here. That's not like true. I don't know. That's what I think. Oops. Just grabbing what's near me. Like that. I don't know. So anyway, this has a long pocket here. Oh, and it's very deep, so that's cool. Um, trying to find something longer. So it's very deep. Huh, okay. And then you have one, two, three pockets here for card um, pockets, which is so nice. Oh my gosh, this leather feels so amazing. I always wanted Boss Babe leather, and um, so now I have it. Haha. <laughs> It looks so tiny. I don't know how it's coming across, um, but it's it's very, you know, Hobonichi sized, which is funny. I don't know. And it smells like leather. No weird, awkward smell. You can see here that the stitching's a little odd right here because I didn't want a pen loop because, I mean, I have just been losing my mind with the pen loop, so I passed. So you can see where they kind of have to go and do the back stitching, which is fine. No worries there. Um, oh, it's just so nice, and it still feels very light, even though you can see here. Oh, yeah. You can see how much thinner it is right here um, if you don't add anything. But um, pockets are part of the fun, right? <laughs> That is so beautiful, and I love the black um, stitching with black elastic. I'm just filling it, and the butterfly is so lovely. Aw, yes. Oh, <laughs> so nice. Okay, so um, let me show you this. This is um, the floating pen loop, which I do have on my other Foxy Fix, and I love it. I love this pen loop, and I feel like everyone should just get together in the travel notebook um or planning community and every traveler's notebook should just have a floating pen loop because they are way better than the nonsense that goes over here. Um, it's just so cool. And I ended up getting a small one this time. So when I what I read in the information in the description down below, because I have um, the, I don't know if they're small, I think they're small, medium, and large. But what I read was that the slits are supposed to be exactly the same where the pen goes in. It's just um, a smaller piece of leather. So you can still fit the same size pen in it. It's just um, the leather piece is smaller. So um, let me show you. This is how it goes in. Oh, I love it. It's awesome. Yes. And I just, this is peach, which is not really who I am, but I wanted to be like fun and different. And I'm really into orange as well right now. I don't know, oranges and peaches are just, I don't know who I am at the time. And so I thought I would try that. Doesn't it look beautiful? I think it does. And since it's spring and it's going to be summer, I thought a bright color, since this is so dark, would be kind of striking and awesome. And I think that I did a good job, I don't know. Plus, I always um, find that whenever I don't use a string or something that I've ordered um, with a notebook right away, I eventually do come back to it, so it's always good to have them. And I didn't order, like when you order this, you can ask them to put it on, and I didn't because I really like black on black right now, <laughs> so I might add this later. This ended up being, let's measure this out quickly here. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So eight and three fourths. Beautiful. I was going to order one of those um, gallon leathers, 
but the one that I wanted they actually didn't have on Amazon and I tried to order it from their website but they they go through something called pay you not PayPal and I don't know if you have to have an account but when I tried to order it it was like sorry and it couldn't order it so I thought maybe it was just my bank so I asked my boyfriend the same thing happened when he tried to order it but I didn't order it because I liked the one that zips up and they don't have that on Amazon they have the one that's sort of like this that just is like a square one that um, doesn't have an elastic to close or anything um, and what I've seen in videos is that when you put the um, the weeks inside of it it basically like I don't know it sticks out weird like the edges stick out kind of oddly and I didn't like the way it looked I also wanted to order one from mystics little gifts but when I went on to mystics little gifts um, I could not find any pictures not on um, her website, not on her Instagram, of what the weeks looked like, like the layout or anything. So I'm assuming that it's exactly the same layout as the notebooks, like the traveler's notebooks you would order just in, um, you know, weeks form. So I, I didn't want to order it without really knowing. Uh, so I don't know. That's why I ended up at Foxy Fix and I really wanted to try out the Boss Babe leather. And this was a good reason to do that because I really didn't need another TN, but I did need a cover for my weeks um I was I'm a little confused still because I've been looking at this and in the picture I mean I don't think I was supposed to order anything else um but maybe I was supposed to in the picture I'm pretty sure it showed that it came with elastics on the inside which obviously like a string this one doesn't have that I don't know what that's about so let me show you um let me take this off here. Somebody asked me the other day where I ended up getting this from, this pen holder um, or pen clip, whatever you'd like to call it. This I ended up getting from the Hobonichi website. They sell them in like three different colors and I love this thing. It's amazing and I lost it for a really long time and when I was doing spring cleaning I found it. Um, but this is the cover on cover on here and I had planned on going ahead in stringing the uh, Midori style string that should be here uh, through here so it'd be in between the cover on cover and the actual Hobonichi weeks um, so that I could still have use of this amazing cover because I love the pockets on the inside I think that you can just you know stuff so much in here that I really wanted to keep the cover on cover um, on here now I can certainly do that and still like you know stick it in like it's supposed to fit in like this um, and you can you can let it rest like that or you can stick this side in here and let it rest like this um, but I lose either this back part or the front part pockets of the cover so I didn't want to do that so anyway um, let me go ahead and take off the cover on cover because I have so much stuff in here just to kind of show you how this looks enough in there and I don't think it'll go anymore with the cover on cover I just don't want to bend it and break it. Okay, it's going a little. Okay, let's see. No. All right, just kidding. I'm going to take the cover off. Let's try it in the back here. Oops. Oh, look at how that slides in perfectly. I don't know how far back. So it actually slides all the way to like the crease practically, which is nice. Oh, look how beautiful that looks. Is that not just the coolest thing ever? And then this goes over like that. It's the perfect little cover. Oh, it's not too, it doesn't add too much bulk or anything. It's going to fit beautifully in my purse. I love it. I love it so much. Oh, this is great leather by the way it's just like really nice I love it what do you guys think oh it's just so lovely but I really really want to have my cover on cover because I love all these pockets they make me so happy so I might have to do some DIYing and just you know be brave and put some holes in here and if I had known that I would have not gotten the butterfly because it's 
it might get in the way. And that really, really sucks. Oh, Foxy Fix. Why won't you let me love you? All right. So anyway, I did get a beautiful notebook. I love the leather. I love the smell. Um, these are a little bit bigger than... A lot bigger, actually. Or I should say wider, rather, um, than a business card. So I don't know that they will fit in here. But business cards fit perfectly fine, which means that IDs and things will probably fit nicely as well. Let me see. Yep, these are just a smidge too wide to really fit in there nicely. I could shove them in there, but they're hard to get out. So that's okay. And then here in the back, I don't want to put this back here because the stencil, like the leather, is thick enough that it would probably bend it. You know what I mean? Like you see how it's popping up because it's like bending it down here. That's okay. So pretty. And I am glad that I didn't get the pen loop because I am I'm over pen loops right now. I don't even know. We'll see how it all goes. This is so pretty. Gosh. I really hate to have the cover on cover on it because it is that kind of pretty, but with the white you just kind of have to. It'll be stained up in no time. And I don't think I could put this in here without it. Yeah, it's going to cause an issue. So I'm definitely going to have to add in the um, Lord Strum 1917, you know, stickable pen loop as well as, I don't know, possibly figuring out the situation of stringing this, putting some holes in it, stringing this so that I can keep my pen loop here because that's something I could do too but I understand that it is a, a perfect cover or perfect fit cover and so it's meant to fit you know to slide in like this and you're supposed to slide this into here if you'd like I don't care to do that well wow, these are stretchy AF look at that can you see it's black I'm sorry so you can't tell as much but it is very stretchy I mean you can just fit all kind look at that Yes, this is not like um, the what's it called the uh, Chic Sparrow pockets where I feel like when, whenever I end up getting the pockets on the inside and they have this long pocket here I can never really fit my fingers or anything really in here that's not skinny but you could fit all kinds of things in here I mean just look at that it's like very nice amount of space in there but now we definitely have God, this is so pretty. We definitely have a video out there of these um, perfect covers by Foxy Fix. I'm just still, I will update you on Instagram, so definitely follow me there. And I will try at some point to put this on um, because I like my pen up here in the front. So I'm probably going to restring this. And if you didn't know, the restringing kits come with a needle, which is really cool, and they already feed this through, so it's a pretty easy to put this in there without any issues. I mean, I've never had a problem, but I've only owned one other one, so there's that. Look how pretty that's gonna look. Sweet. All right, so don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I hope that this was helpful. Thanks for watching, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.